pretty much nothing I can do here on my machine. So I'm just assuming that this is going to be sacked. You one shot's going to heavy slam next turn. I mean, it kind of sucks, but I mean, I don't really have anything to kill Celesteela. So, I mean, Andy dodges the play rough, which is nice. Everything is just not going my way this battle at all. He gets the defense boost. This thing is freaking tanky as crap. So I go into combo and I was like, okay, maybe I can get two focus blasts off and kill this thing. First one lands, good deal. Of course he's gonna go into this stall game. Leech Seed Protect. Because why not? He withdraws, and of course, we'll tap a blue. So at this point, I think he's just kind of screwing with me. He's trying to call my predictions on abilities and see if he can resist them, but that does a lot of damage anyway. And I'm going to get the grassy surge recovery, which is definitely going to come in handy. Of course, he's still got leech seed going. So really, I'm gonna carry him flash cannon on combo, but I'm not really sure. Like, okay, so I use flash cannon, and of course he switches out into Zygarde. So flash cannon not gonna do much against this. Yeah, about to take his HP. It's like, okay, I can one shot this thing with Draco Meteor. So I'm just gonna go into a Draco. He's going to keep getting his leftovers from Leech Seed and the Grassy Surge. Goes into Soul Stealer. So Draco going to connect, but not going to do much against this. And my special attack is going to drop. So this Como is kind of needs to switch out now. I have a special attack drop, there's not much I can do. I got my Carton in the back, maybe I can get a sword stance and one shot this thing. Or at least go for something. He has a good switch in, he went for protect. I get a sword stance. So I think I can kill this thing with Sacred Sword from a plus two, where he's at, but of course he goes straight into the flamethrower and that's four times effective and we're dead. Didn't know he had flamethrower. So now he gets another defense boost. Of course he switched out, so he's just plus one still. Alright, come on, it's up to you. At this point, like I've pretty much assume that I've lost the game. There's no way I can win unless he just totally screws this up. He's PP stalling me with these protects pretty hard. I only have five on Draco, Clanging Scales, and Focus Blast. Of course, I did not think he was going to switch. thought he was just going to stall and still steal it. Focus Blast actually does a decent now of damage. Then we get to find out that, oh, he's not just like our 50. This I got complete. This final form. And of course I go into Draco and he switches again for the immunity. At this point I'm thinking, okay, he's really just trying to 
mess with me. Like, he knows that he's won. There's no way he can lose. He's just scoring with me. I'm going to walk into the flash cannon, and he's actually not going to switch out. Almost get the kill there. If I thought he had crit, he would have died. He goes for a superpower. I'm not really sure why he stayed in for this. Because it didn't do much. And he's kind of in a position now where he switches to still steal, and I can predict the Draco and kill it. Or, Psyguard rather, still steal. I'm not really sure what I can do. And then he goes on to that. I go for clean scales thinking that he's going to move Zygarde. Of course he didn't. So at this point, I'm thinking, okay, Silsteela is slower than I am. If he protects, he might be able to leech these Stalden, but he's going to have to... He doesn't have a leech suit down right now. So this Grassy Surge will heal him up, but he's not going to get enough HP back. And he is in kill range, even for a Dragon-type move at this point. So, even if he switches to Zygarde, I'm fine with that. Alfie, Tapabulu, I'm fine with that. So now he's one, he, I think that he's kind of found out that he could potentially lose this game. He goes into Zygarde. Okay. I'm thinking, okay, he just wants me to Draco and he's going to switch into Tapu. So I go for Flash Cannon thinking that he's going to go into Tapu Bulu. Which of course he didn't. So I'm scared at this point that he's going to do something, but he uses Rift. Okay, is this thing really going to just rest on me? Does he have Sleep Talk? I don't know. I go for Draco, he avoids it. And he does indeed have sleep talk. So I'm just thankful he didn't have a dragon time move in there. Because I resisted that pretty well. At this point I have to one shot him, I'm thinking. Because if the sleep talk's another one of those, I'm dead. It's a two shot. I didn't want a Draco because I didn't want to miss again. He uses sleep talk. And he gets coil. <laughs> so at this point, he's not going to outspeed me. The clinging scales, he's dead. And he has one Pokemon left in the red, who is weak to steal. And I outspeed him. So, Flash Cannon here. There's no way he can win. He can't stall me out. Because Flash Cannon's going to do three quarters of his health regardless. And that's speed me. Como oh freaking clutch dude. I don't know if he was just messing with me and accidentally lost that game. But it sure did seem that way. Anyways, GG. That's what you get for bringing a little Pokemon.